The friends attend Joey's new musical, Freud. The musical is quite awful to them. Regardless of the bad play, Joey gets a business card from Estelle Leonard, a talent agent. Chandler asks out a beautiful woman named Aurora. He goes out on a date with her, during which it comes out that Aurora is not only married to a guy named Rick, but has a boyfriend, Ethan. Nonetheless, she still wants to see Chandler for sexual reasons alone. Chandler thinks it's the perfect relationship. All fun, talking, and sex, but no responsibility for anything. The girls are shocked, but Ross is jealous. Joey, meanwhile, notes that he has to know he's dating more people than his girlfriend. Joey's new agent manages to obtain him a role in the new Al Pacino movie. However, the role is Pacino's butt double in a shower scene. Despite this, Joey manages to ruin it by overacting his role, which later gets him fired. The friends console him and reassure him that his big break is coming, Chandler is enjoying things with Aurora, but deep down, he wants to commit. Aurora clearly does not want this, as she is now with a fourth guy, Andrew. This makes the two break up. At Rachel's apartment, Monica reveals how obsessive she is with cleanliness and organization when she disapproves of Rachel's subtle changes to the living room after cleaning it. The guys think it's pretty much a flaw of Monica's, but she tries not to make a big deal out of it. However, she can't even bring herself to sleep by thinking of a pair of sneakers she left haphazardly in the living room just to let the guys think that she, like them, is a cook.